Hi and welcome back to the second part of video tutorial series for OCDSB staff members and in this tutorial I'm going to show you how you can take advantage of something called multiple inboxes so that you can categorize your incoming Gmail and separate it from any posts that might have arrived from your group conferences in Google Groups separating that from draft emails you haven't hit send on yet and separating that out from any emails that were over here that you put stars beside so you can use this as something of a to-do list. These are all tricks that are going to take place on any machine that you configure and I'll show you how to do that now. And by the way of course pause and rewind if you need to review one of the steps. From inside of Gmail I'm going to go over to the gear, click it and go to settings and under the settings I'm going to go to a submenu called labs right there. And under labs, we want to find the one called multiple email or multiple inboxes. So just go to the search uh, field and type in MUL and it'll bubble right to the top and enable that. And then remember to hit the save changes button and it'll take you back to the inbox and you should see the results right away. If you have any starred or draft emails, they will go on top of the regular inbox. Now I find it's worth configuring this so it looks a little bit better. So I'm going to go back and find the gear above the inbox section and click on it so that you can get back to settings and you'll see you now have a new sub menu item called multiple inboxes and this is where you can start to customize things. I'm going to make this occur on the right side of the inbox instead and hit the save changes just to see the effect and when you do now your inbox material is here and your starred materials on top of your draft materials are showing up over on the right hand side. But now let's get it so that we can take this JMSS conference or whatever your group label is that you've used before from part one. Let's make sure that it shows up on the right side too. So clicking on it, you'll notice in the search bar at the top, you get the text string that you need to put into the configuration. So right mouse click this and copy it. In this case, it goes label, colon, and then the name of the conference with dashes instead of spaces. Back over to the settings one more time and multiple inboxes one more time. I would like that to occur at the very top but I've got to paste it in here somewhere for now so I'm going to paste it in pane 2 and paste. If you want to rearrange the order of these things all you have to do is just control X cut and paste these things where you want them to go. If you leave blanks above or below it's no biggie everything works just fine so I've got a couple of empty panes up top and I should have the conference after that. And another handy handy option here is to put a panel title in this as well. And so I'm going to do that right now. I'm going to call this JMSS group. I'm going to call this drafts. And I'm going to call this to-do list because it makes more sense than starred. Hit the save changes button and go on back to your inbox. It's the only place where this works. And you can see it. And you'll notice right away all the labels that we colored in the last tutorial are showing up up top. And we've got a nice handy little label at the top of each one of these panels. That's it.